Take the zombie head. Come here, zombie head. Come. Come to me. Come to me. Do I not have the stuff in my pockets? What? Oh, there we go. Zombie head. Bam. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm feeling a bit under the weather. Uh. <laughs> How's it look? Oh, that's so cool. Okay, I'll put that back on. I'm going to put it in here and get rid of the bench. Those fence things. Perfect. Oh, man. Oh, I dropped my sword by mistake. Get out of here, everything else. That's it. Right. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to carry on heading down this way and just see if we can... I mean, how many diamonds do we have now? We have four diamonds so far. We are getting there. Uh, we just need to find like some more. And we could... If this ends up becoming a like a real fruitless endeavor, um, then we can always uh, go with plan B. Um, and plan B, my friends, is a good plan, actually, because we can uh, just do, do a bit of strip mining. That's, that's, that's plan B. So I'll take these out. Uh, we're going to just get rid of this single piece of stone here. We're going to make a second. Wow, that's, not a, that's definitely not a, uh, a thing at all. That was ridiculous. There we go. Uh, we'll put those on the floor. We'll take this out. I'm going to put this here. I'm going to put him uh, there, Robocaf, that is. And we'll, I won't worry about these iron pieces of iron. Or, I mean, well, let's have a look. Is there anything that we really don't need to worry about? I kind of need everything else. Well, I guess those four torches are less important. But what I'll do is go one, two, three, four. I'll put them all on the wall like that. I'll pick up the rest of those ones there. And then that should mean that whatever it was I just picked up, these boots, there we go. Done. Boom. Right, this stuff can stay here. And now we have two thingies. Th thingies, you know. Buckets. There you go. That's a word. Sweet. That's it. And we're, we're, we're sorted now. This is it. We've now got infinite water supply. We've got all these different ways to like explore right now, which we're going to. You better believe we are going to just try to find everything around here. Hopefully, eventually finding like... So there's permafrost up there. Um, we're going to hopefully try to find ourselves some really, really nice uh, collection of diamonds around here somewhere. The the walls are literally teeming with, like, ores, which is brilliant. can make things a lot easier for us to try to find some bits and pieces if we need anything. Uh, we've been this way, haven't we? Yeah, we've definitely been down here. So we'll head back again, and hopefully... There'll be like another way we could go somewhere around here. I guess we could probably head up a little bit and go along that abandoned mine shaft area there. Uh, we also want to go this way as well because currently they can't get across. So I'm going to make it so they can get across. Fight them with my Osmium Sword. Oh no, Creeper! Creeper got behind us. And they're trying to take names, so we'll just take them out, hopefully. Get out of here! Oh, he's actually really angry. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's eat some apples. There's a baby zombie. If he sees us, we are we are done because they are super quick. Let's get this this piece of headgear. Is that headgear? No, it's not even headgear. There's a little random carrot there as well. Knock it about. That's fine. Oh, we go. So we're we're actually running into another kind of um, area, which is good. Sweet. Put a torch down. Oh yeah. Okay. So we're here. Right. That's fine. So there are no, like, super obvious diamonds, it seems. Just keep on doing this. Put a torch down. Nothing down that way. Nothing under there. Uh, we may as well go this way as well. Seems we can. There's the baby zombie. Oh, he was a one hit KO. That's fine then. I thought it was going to be a whole lot harder than that. That's good. Uh, more silver ores. And this way... We're linking back up to the stuff that we've already done, I think. Uh, but this time, at least, we can now make it just so we can... We know where we've been because we've got all this fantastic, delicious ore and uh, delicious buckets of water. <laughs> Not quite sure how they're delicious, but it's fine. There we go. Right. Is this gold? No, this is ferrous. Redstone. Osmium. Iron. Tin. Iron. Well, I can't believe we're just like leaving behind ores. It's the way it has to be done, guys. We have to prioritize here because we only need the gold and the diamonds. I've only found four diamonds so far, though. If I can find them before winter comes, then we'll be able to work on like something really exciting when, when she shows up. 
like we can probably work on getting the exhibit ready and then uh, get everybody to choose names for all dinosaurs, which I know you guys are dying to do because that's always like a really fun thing, isn't it? So we'll, we'll definitely be doing that. Um, ha. Huh. Nope. Nothing. Okay. Well, let's... I'll tell you... Oh, hang on a second. What's this? Oh, I just saw a little area. A little secret area, mate. Just up there. What's up there, mate? I want to have a look at that. I'm going to have to just have a look down here as well. Because I can't help. My curiosity is getting the better of me. Put a torch down. Does that just link up to there? I just can't quite see, like, underneath in certain places. Have a look. Is it a way that I've been... Oh man, it's, no, it's just like a dead end, I think. Oh, there's another piece here, is that like a... No, we definitely been that way because it's all blocked in, so that's fine. And then that's just nothing over there. Okay, right, so. Let's head back to the cavern, if we can, and go up the cavern. Put a torch there, because it's getting really dark. Uh, and... Yeah, we'll go up to that thing there. So we're going to have to get some of our cobblestone out and build like a makeshift staircase. There we go. Perfect. Check it out. Oh, oh my god. Is that... Oh god, no, we're going to just get, gonna get it done if we don't go and take these guys out. What? Uh, there must be a, some kind of spawner there. I guess. Because like, all of a sudden there's like a million... Monsters who are just like, look at that guy. Look at that guy up there. Oh. How aggressive. Alright, so let's see if we can take some of these arrows because arrows will be very useful for us. Piece of stone, get out of here. There we go. We've got some, some arrows now which we can use. Go back up here again and hopefully find a way for us to get on there. Um, if we just get rid of this and then put like a piece there and then like a piece there. And then like a piece there, and then like a piece there. There you go. Sweet. We're up. Oh god. God damn it. I'm in a, I'm in a cobweb. Get out of here. And this one as well. Look, he's wearing some really beautiful armor. Ugh. Get out of here. I would let those those experience orbs, but there are other things afoot right now. I'm gonna have to try to prioritize my my work. Uh, Let's see if we can spot anything. What's that? It's more tin. Okay, so this links up to over there and does carry on going that way. Um, but it also goes this way and links up to a second cave with a... What the hell are you? Oh my god. He really hurts. We'll put a torch down. Oh, he's just a regular... It's just a straight up ogre. God damn, he's strong. He's really painful. He He's quite soft, but he really hits you very hard. Man, oh man. Right, that's all nothing to worry about. This is a second cavern that we're in now. In. Not, not the same as the first one. Uh, let's just do it. Let's just have a look around. We may as well do that. Put some water down so we can walk along it. Uh, look around for more. Oh, some water that goes like a million miles up. And then more water that I just placed down. There we go. Breaking that up. Sorted. Uh, some frost. Permafrost, that is. Permafrost is um, actually quite a dangerous thing. Permafrost tends to break quarries. but Well, well it did, anyway, back in the day. Uh, back on the old server. Let's find out if it does on this one as well. I don't know if it will. So I'm not going to panic too much about permafrost. Uh, okay, this is now another area with what looks like just just some beautiful like caverns that we have under underground. This is really awesome. Uh, there we go. Put that up there, and nothing else. Does it? Is there anything? Is that, no, it's not diamonds. I don't think. I'll double check. Could have been. No, no diamonds. Just tin, tinny tin tin. Not by the hair of my tinny tin tin. Okay. So, that's this cavern taken care of, um, which means that we just need to head back into our abandoned mine shaft again because there's nothing here that's kind of helping us out, I don't think. So, let's just double check. All good. Head up here again and get back into this mine shaft, I guess. 
because this is one that we can go through. Perfect. There's some lapis there, which we currently don't need. Uh, permafrost. And, okay, I kind of feel like I want to go over here. So let's try and do that without getting ruined by a skeleton here. Just keep on going. Don't look back. No prisoners. Okay, there we go. Right, we're here. Now there's an enderman. I'm going to have to try to hurt. Oh, God, he's quite painful. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, man, that was a lot of... That was a lot of hearts he just stole off me. <sighs> okay. Another little, little area for mushrooms and some silver. I kind of feel like we are going to have to resort to strip mining here. But uh, we'll do that off of camera if we resort to that because that'll get super boring for you guys. So no, nothing there either. Oh, man. This is absolutely immense. I can't, I can't believe how, like, just crazy this area is like it's it's insane how big it is and I, I love the fact that we have this just like knocking about underneath our underneath our base you know it's really awesome oh god he knocked us off you cheeky bugger you oh god there's one there bang ha, that's a skeleton he has he has gear that I require yeah yeah no nothing nothing from the bugger Oh, well, at least we have hearts being regenerated. This creeper is stuck, I'm afraid. GG, creeper. Creeper, creeper GG. Okay, right. No, I think I think this is probably quite a good place to uh, to take a pause, to take a, have a break and have a Kit Kat as well. Uh, unless we find anything amazing in the next kind of like five minutes or so, then I think we'll call it there um, because that's quite a nice... Quite a nice hearty three episodes that we've managed to got for you, get for you guys. And I don't want to spend, you know, like 30 or 40 episodes doing this because then you guys will get insanely bored and that would, is not kind of what I want from, from this. So we've got the right height for um, doing strip mines here and we could probably just go in one direction and we would find, lol, one direction, and we would find like just amazing things and we can realistically just by literally just going right okay so we explored everything up to this point and then we haven't explored anything over let's say this way let's go this way and we can just start going and then eventually we will find something incredible i expect that's just going to be the way that this works ah oh, dear oh dear oh well, there's a torch here oh this is the that connects up to the other one that i was doing a second ago brilliant is it eyes position or feet position? I think it's feet position 12. I'm pretty sure. And we can go this way. And then we might break into something else that's like super duper interesting. It seems like, I don't know what you guys think, but I'm like really, really impressed with, with the area that we've been given. I think that we, we have like stumbled upon something really, really awesome. And I mean, we have like some frozen meat here as well. Permafrost, get you out of here some books which i don't really need um but like not only is the overground of this place just absolutely fantastic has loads of really interesting resources and all that kind of stuff but also the underground is absolutely teeming with just like areas to explore which is insane i love it so much it's fantastic and that we just like broken through here uh, which means now we're in another area and i can use a water bucket to uh, get this all taken care of go through here see if we can find like some more interesting stuff ah oh, this is just brilliant i love it and i hope you guys are really enjoying this because i mean oh, this, oh, okay we're just we're gonna break the end of the episode after just checking out this little cavernous bit here there's a little there's a little area oh is it more more of our more of our delightful oh it is look wow this is actually connected up but was n not ever reached, it looks like. Silver, 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 silver. <laughs> okay. Well, let's just have a quick look and just see whether or not there's anything really awesome. It's, a ho it's like a whole other area. Oh, man, it looks like it is. It looks like it's just like an entirely new... Oh, it's a dungeon. Or something. No, it's not a dungeon. Look, it looks like it was a dungeon. I thought that was a dungeon. Okay. Oh, that was really, really dodgy, sketchy jump there. Okay, this is... Alright, so this links up to this uh, area. And if we go this way... 
silver, tin, lead, some berries, um, <laughs> and just like some, oh, oh cool, some essence berries as well. Sweet. Those are cool because they give you experience points. Like, whoop, whoop, whoop. I think. I think we can eat those and get experience points. I think that's that's how it works. Pretty confident. Uh, we'll get rid of some of this. Concentrated essence berries. Yeah. Uh, let's have a look. Yep, just gives us some like experience points. That's so cool. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. Well, I think we're at a point now where we've explored like a really good amount of stuff and we can probably take it from here. If I find anything else really, really interesting, what I'll do for you guys is I will tap it onto the end of this episode or I'll tap it onto the end of next episode and we will just sort of like come back and be like, hey guys, look what we found whilst we were away. This place is really cool and awesome and stuff. Um, but I think it looks like we've kind of explored everything. So what I'm probably going to do is just set up a, a nice strip mine and just, just do some old-fashioned strip mining and get, get ourselves the, the bits and pieces that we so desperately desire to make this quarry which is the the gold and the diamonds and then once i've got those things i'll come back to you guys we'll go back to to our base uh, to the visitor center we'll start to work on the quarry which will give us all the materials that we need to start working on like rooms and all that kind of stuff and make everything look really really cool but just before i do that just before i do that i just want to double check and see if there's anything up around here because i kind of feel like there's an awful lot of zombies. Uh, I am being sniped. Yep. A good thing there was some water beneath me. Oh, he's got quite a good bow. Did he drop it? He did. Okay, what is it? Power 1, the same as what I had. Okay, never mind. Right, yep, thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, don't forget to like the episodes if you've enjoyed this little caving experience with me today. Uh, and subscribe if you really love it and you want to see more because there is certainly plenty more coming. There is actually... In case you don't know, in case you've been living under a rock or something, there's an episode every day. There's an episode of this show, Jurassic Park, Zucas Jurassic Park, every single day. So, uh, so yeah, make sure you're subscribed, and then you'll be told whenever the episode goes live, and it will it will give you a little email and be like, right, this this is up now. You should you should definitely go and watch it. Um, and I think that you guys hopefully are, uh, are would would enjoy that. So yes, until next time, guys. I've been Calf of the CAFCast. Thank you very much for watching and when I get back we will have ourselves hopefully a super awesome quarry or the materials to build one. So until then, take care and I'll see you all soon. Bye bye. You've been watching the CAFCast We hope you have enjoyed the show Don't forget to check out all of our other videos Oh and be sure to subscribe to us if you like what you see That way I'll know to make more And that you really like me So You've been watching the Kefcast We hope you have enjoyed the show Don't forget to check out All of our other videos